Hey guys, today I'm going to be explaining core badges and core badge patterns. Basically, core badges are just like an extra badge that you can equip. It's basically like a free badge. So you can see here on the right side of my badge screen, it says equipped core badges. So you can see here that I'm going to take one of these off. So you see that tier three badges cost seven points, right? So this one costs five points. We're going to put this on for five points, right? And you can see we have seven points available and now it's only two points available but when i core it you can see it says press y to core i get those five badge points back so you want to core the tier three badge points because you'll get the most badge points back see if i core here i'll only get three points for a bronze you know what i mean as of here well i'll get five points as a as a bronze so you say how do you core them how do you get core challenges because you see in the bottom it says core challenge so basically how you get core challenge is you just have to use the badge in a game so as you can see here dead eye it says complete in the bottom because i've completed the amount of times i need to use dead eye in any single game my career virtual rivals park but the thing is that get people tricked up is you need to have the badge equipped to be able to be making core badge progress if that makes sense. So I need to have Deadeye equipped on gold if I want my my Deadeye core challenge to be worked on on gold. You know what I mean? So I can get this one core. You know what I mean? So I got to have it activated. So you see this one, I can, I can core. You know what I mean? All right. All right, guys. Now I'm going to be explaining what core badge patterns are. So the way you unlock them is you got to come over here to deuces and talk to this dude with the hat. And then you got to fully complete his quest. His quest is going to be like five virtual rival games in your MyCore. And then there's going to be mini quests in between. Once you finish that, it's going to give you a perk, the extender perk, which is a good perk. And it's also going to give you something called core badge patterns. And it's only going to unlock you one, but I don't know if it's a glitch or something. But once you unlock one, it unlocks all of them. So I'm going to come over here and show you what they are. When I come to my badges, you can see under the badges, when I click in my left stick, it says switch core badges pattern. All right. When I click that, you can see that there's different patterns. Pattern one, pattern two, pattern three, pattern four, and pattern five. So pattern one is just you have one core badge for every single one. When you go to pattern two, you can see I have two finishing, one playmaking, and one defense. When I go to pattern three, you see it's two shooting, one playmaking, and one defense. Pattern four is one finishing, two playmaking, and one defense. And pattern five is one finishing, one playmaking, and two defense. So as you guys can see here, what I can do is now when I have two playmaking badges, what I can do is I can I can core two playmaking badges instead of just one. So I can, the areas that I'm weak, I can focus on, or even the areas that I'm strong, I can also focus on. So that just helps you. So let's see here, let's say a gold, or yeah, a hall of fame tier three would cost eight points. So, if you have two core badges, you basically get 16 points for free on that thing. So you just gotta you just gotta learn and just figure out which pattern is best for you and which pattern is gonna help out your build like the best. Me personally, I like pattern four because I like I like ball handling. So yeah, just the way you do that is you just gotta talk to that dude right there, Sam, complete his quest. I don't know if his name is Sam or like he's just the pirate dude right there in Deuces. Gotta just complete the quest and then you'll get it. Appreciate this and hope it helps.